famous for taking Kiwi catchphrases like Oh for Awesome and old school logos like Thingy and Goodnight Kiwi and making them into tees, Mr Vintage is single-handedly responsible for reviving retro iconography and making it cooler than ever to wear Kiwi Ana with pride. So today we're meeting Mr Vintage in the flesh to find out what the inspiration was for this terrific brand. Let's go dated there with the tea. Perfect. Guys, this is Rob. Hey Rob. Hey Katie. Now, wow, the store looks awesome. Now you started in 2004 when it was just you, one man band. Yep. Now you have 10 staff. What inspired you to get the whole thing started? Um, at the time I was at university and I, was, I had a part-time job for a wine company and I was buying similar sort of t-shirts um, from the United States and, and online and I was wearing them around and people would comment on them and so started buying more, started selling on Trade Me and um, it sort of just snowballed from there. Now one of the coolest things about Mr Vintage is that they crank out a different design every single day. So in a year that's 365 different ideas. Where did they all come from? The idea factory right here. <laughs> <laughs> now I know that social media is also a really big thing yep. for you guys. Um, why is that? It's, it's just a great way to communicate with our customers, uh, to have a conversation with them, uh, to get feedback, um, to get t-shirt ideas and um, I think yeah, the customers really appreciate that. Oh, you guys got quite a lot of friends on Facebook. How many is it now? Uh, I think it's just over 20,000 now and about 4,000, 5,000 on Twitter. So yeah, it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a huge community. So what's been your most popular logo print that's been done to date? Uh, the most popular since we've been going will probably be the, the, the brown Kiwi slang t-shirt. It's got the blue print with all the, the Kiwi, Kiwi words on it. Keep New Zealand beautiful, and a lot of topical t-shirts. Um, there's a couple of Paul Henry ones. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, people seem to love him. You guys have done so much in the last seven years, and now you're even collaborating with some amazing New Zealand artists like Brad Novak and Shane Hansen with this artist series. Can you tell us a bit about that? Yeah, well, um, I teed up a meeting with both Brad and Shane, and and told them the idea for the artist series and um, yeah they were both keen so um, very privileged to be working with uh, the likes of those guys. So what does the future hold for Mr Vintage? Um, last year we, we started licensing out our brand um, into stationery and that's available nationwide in Whitcalls so we'll look at doing more of that with the brand um, and we're also eyeing up Australia as well we see a big gap in the market there for uh, a brand like Mr Vintage over here. So, yeah. Oh look out world here you come. Yeah I hope so. In fact you know what you've got so many t-shirts but do you like to give some away maybe? Yeah maybe we need to give some away. <laughs> <laughs> cool that would be awesome. How many do you think we get? Maybe one, two? Uh, I reckon we can do 20. 20? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. We need some space so yeah. <laughs> that would be amazing. So if you guys would like to get your hands on one of those 20 t-shirts from Mr Vintage then head along to erinsimpsonshow.tv and tell us one of their most popular designs. Now there's a few in there for you. Thanks so much for having us today Rob. No Easy as. We'll see you guys soon.